And what's the best novel you've read in the last year? Um, I would say, um, oh, um, Song of Apollo, I loved, and, um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Okay. Fair. Worst mumblers. In the world would be, in my opinion, mum, mum. mumblers. Mum. Visual. L l let me do this. So, so Blast Last is obviously one. Yeah. Um, and then uh, a mope is obviously one. Uh, it, it is feminine it, sensory, but yeah. I would say visual would be even worse. Yeah, yeah. I also think that the masculine DE can talk once it gets rolling. Like, <laughs> like you mean, I'm not going to be able to see you mean, rowling. You mean rowling. I mean rowling. Once it gets rowling. Once the masculine DE gets rolling, it'll it'll just truck driver. But like starting, it feels like that's where these it, guys. It are. feels like it would be afraid of offending. So that would be another thing. Would be also decider would have a hard time talking. Yeah, because they're, they're of the checking Because the programs, everything. the programs are having to go, shit, that's gonna offend right. the tribe. And if the, the if the tribe is masculine, then the tribe is scary and worry about, right. worrying about them. So yeah, like I can't even fucking talk. Goddamn talking, words are hard. Yeah, all of those you parts. You get all of those, yeah. So what's- That's why you're not too bad, because you you are blast last, but you're, and you're visual, which gives you masculine blast at the top. I'm, I'm once I get into my masculine blast, yeah. unfortunately, it's hard to turn it off. Now I'm right. just flying down the hill. Yeah. And then yeah, it takes me 50 years to just say uh, one damn concept because of my dumb, uh, you know, SE brain. So the thing that I'm seeing though is she's got the, I can't not look all over the that, place. That. And, and it, like, she'll still be able to bring up details. That's another thing that I see that people are like, how do you know the modalities? It's like, they actually will show that, that. they're pulling from a visual world and you could see them checking. And like masculine sensories, they do a different kind of like, Remember the guy, T-E-N-E -E -E guy? T-E-N-E, yeah. Play, consume, blast. Right, doesn't uh, she feel more masculine she, sensory? Yeah, like yeah. just kind of like, down, like grabbing from down here. Yes. Okay. Versus so looking up, up here. here. That must be the different parts of the that's, brain. That's they do how say they, like. That's how they do the bullshit. The the fucking tracking the yeah, eyes. The eye, eye accessing. Oh God! Here we go. Yeah. Here we go. Just get some info dominant stuff in here. Yes. This this shit. It's all fairly real. It is vi visually. Oh, Let me just. There you go. So yeah, I, I I like the idea that that there is a creating section and there is a recalling section. I would guess that part of Part of this, where that's yeah. this up yeah, pictures yeah, yeah. up and it, 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 if you track people the best like we played around this for a couple of years the best thing to do just like with typing is start with your known people so so bother the hell out of yourself and your friends and family right and just watch them move their eyes and then when they're done talking just say hey what were you doing yeah. were you looking at something or were you recalling a memory and they'll give you like kind of fake shit you can kind of work that out yeah but you'll kind of notice that then sometimes it'll be different i remember one one guy a visual estj guy that he was always looking down his own, like, but his, but you could tell his, that his yeah, canvas same, was over there. Yeah, he's like you could tell, like you could tell the, the looking at a canvas versus. Uh, I know who you're talking to. to. I know who you're talking about, by the way, which is funny, yeah, ironic. A, he was in the Lord, Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings guy. Yeah, he was a fucking play, Lord of the Rings guy. Visual, visual play last. What was that guy's name? ESTJ. Very handsome. I forget. But handsome his, ESTJ guy. There you go. In Lord of the Rings. What was, it's the, when what was the asking, color? What was the color of your first car? My very first car. Shit. Um, this is so embarrassing. Please don't look. Uh, it, it was, um, okay. i now I remember the car. So you're looking all over. I think you're lying. You're it creating was, a picture. Well, cause it changed colors when I crashed. So watching your eyes, it's going <laughs> up and both sides. It was burgundy. Well, I'm not really asking the color of your goddamn car. Just watching your eyes. Raspberry. Move. And then I rush. crashed. Nobody it. cares. And then it was three different colors because it was, Bondo. What was the noise of the crash? Raspberry. <laughs> was it an ear bonk? Or was it an ear bonk bonk bonk? It was. <laughs> I was like, yeah. Look <laughs> 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 That's it. That's my eyes. These are my eyes. This. Shifty eyes. Creating fart sounds in my head. Talking to Is self. that why your eyes go back and forth? Yeah, but mine, when mine You're go up, like this. when mine go up, I am never visualizing. I, I am down to straight zero visualizing. I'm like trying to get visual back. I have zero visual. There's some visuals that are like photographic memory. Like you and my old buddy Matt Funnelson, I, I both say, out of all the visual people I know, you guys are like higher on the 
like visual get in the way like it extreme the way. extreme visual yeah. now there's people even more so than you that'll do like super photographic and like can't oh, tell yeah. whether they're seeing somebody in the room or they're it's just somebody in their head like yeah you know I've so that, that the spectrum go way up but same with the audios or double masculines they'll have some visual ability right you know to some degree right. and then some audios are even worse so she would be an interesting one so let's say she is uh feminine sensory because she's oh my god visualizing that's what would also make her a really interesting writer because and another thing too that i want to vouch for this so people are going to be mad at her being like what uh dumbledore was gay and i i knew that all along it's like how is she knowing this where is she getting that information it's like if you're creating this ginormously intricate visual world inside your head, you're not going to give all of that information all at once. It's going to like come to you in bits and pieces. And that will be part of the story. You're like, yeah, I'm sorry. I forgot to mention that. I also forgot to mention that there's a fucking vase over there in my head. Fuck you, you know? And it is a part of that feminine it's also, world. What gets them into trouble is that it's not movable because it's, it's it's technically not the feminine sensory. It is the masculine intuition, we yeah. believe. It's the masculine N that's creating it. So the NEs or NIs that have mm -hmm. masculine N, mm -hmm. Savior Demon, doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. It's like, I see it, therefore it's real. Like So for example, like when we're yeah. decorating the house, it's it makes phase one a giant pain in the ass. <laughs> Because you go to sit down Explain with your partner. Explain that. Explain that. You're like, Explain hey, that. let's 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 rearrange the or let's set up the downstairs room. Do we have two couches? Three? Is, is it seating this way? A table? And so like the 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 feminine way is just like I don't know. Let's whiteboard it. Let's explore. Let's move things around. But the like feminine the extreme, intuition. Yeah, or, yeah, whatever. Like like my side or whatever. Like it's it's yeah, feminine intuition. And so it's like with you, it's like I see it. I get this clear picture in my mind, and it's and then it's like. It is extremely frustrating for you to then maneuver to, to like happiness is if in the end it matches up with that original picture. <laughs> now, if outside reality says, hey, your fucking downstairs room isn't even that big. You can't even physically mechanically. You're mad. Yes, because in the visual, it's the not spatial accurate. awareness. It's not accurate. You're like, I'm going to have 10 chairs and, and a trapezius and, and a coffee maker. <laughs> and you're like, hey, the room's like 10 by 10. It's a really small room. Like. They're like, I don't know how you're going to go all that shit in there. And yeah. then there'll be the frustration oh, yeah. that the physical sensory doesn't, <laughs> doesn't match allow you to, to match that up. Yeah. <laughs> no. Or for me, I'm like, I don't know. Yeah, just the, the picture is going to move because you have to move around the limitation of the, the kinesthetic of the room. Right. And you, with your blast play and your masculine sensory, will automatically have a game of we have to create something in layers. Because I can't see it. You can't get see your, it. Yeah, because you, you can't see it. So this is the beauty of having visuals is I can see where this is going. I know the I'll, end I'll like, product. I like have to make cardboard chairs and like yes. lay them out or tape it on the floor. And that is so awful what's to me. That, what's that thing you have on Amazon? Okay, that's three by six. Okay, I'll go and measure it and I'll put a little wood down or whatever so I can spatially... Okay, so how much walk space is 18 inches? I don't know. <laughs> Let Let's me put see. A like, tape ah, on the floor. That's yeah. a little tight. I'm carrying a box. I'm not going to fit through there. <laughs> but it looks marvelous.